What's going on guys? Wanted to make a quick video before I head out for work because I'm not sure if I'm going to be back right in time for the kickoff. It might be a little after kickoff so I just wanted to show you guys something that I was uh, looking at because you guys know how uh, Madden and the NFL basically work hand in hand. And last year this uh, playoff promo basically showed us what was going to happen in the playoffs and therefore the Super Bowl. And one thing I noticed that is very damning, and now it's probably going to make me change my pick, it's the fact that they've already shown Josh Allen as one of the players in the playoffs. So that's not a good sign. So if you look down this list, you see a Packers star player, you see C.J. Stroud, you see Nick Boza, you see Zay Flowers on the Ravens, Josh Allen, you see... Green Bay, you see Jared Goff, right? So, Pacheo, who's missing? You see a Buccaneer, you see another Bill player. So, you should be asking yourself, Cal, who is missing from this list? And who is missing is Lamar Jackson. I haven't seen him, right? I haven't seen Patrick Mahomes, right? I haven't seen Brock Purdy. So, that that's... that's Big time. There's Tua right there. So Tua's there. You see Darius Slay. So there's a bunch of teams there that we haven't seen. So we haven't seen Mahomes. So I don't think the Bills are going to win, guys, honestly. Because they, wouldn't, they re wouldn't reveal Josh Allen if the Bills were actually going to win. They haven't shown Patrick Mahomes. He's the best player. He drives everything. So I, I don't know that the Bills are going to win now. I think they're setting up a Chiefs versus Baltimore matchup now because they haven't shown Lamar Jackson. They haven't revealed Patrick Mahomes yet. So that has to be the reason because they're going to display him next week after they've uh, surpassed the teams this week. That's what I'm thinking. I don't think it's the Bills anymore, guys. See how quickly this shit changes? I don't think it's the Bills anymore. It's probably Baltimore. They're going to have these two play because they haven't revealed the players yet. Usually when they reveal the player, it's because they're going to lose. And it's because they've already been displayed. So why haven't they displayed Lamar Jackson and Patrick Mahomes yet? It's because they're saving them for next week for the NF AFC Championship game and the Super Bowl promo. That's what's going on, guys. So that means San Fran's probably going to win. They've already displayed both of these two teams, Tampa Bay and Detroit. And honestly, I think Tampa Bay has a real chance of beating Detroit, honestly. Like, I think Tampa Bay... Because you got to think, bro, not all these teams... Favorites are going to win, even though the Chiefs, I don't know that they're a favorite. I think the Bills are a favorite, but they already showed Josh Allen, guys, so I have to change my pick because of that. So now my second pick is now my first pick. The Bills can still win, but the fact that they haven't shown us Patrick Mahomes, that makes me think that, that you're going to win this game, guys, just solely based on that. Because those two entities work together, as we saw last year. Patrick Mahomes wasn't revealed, so we knew they were winning, and they won all those those both those weeks leading up to the Super Bowl. Then he got the MVP and the Super Bowl MVP, literally before the game happened. So it showed us everything, guys. So I think it's going to do the same thing. Most people aren't even looking at this at all. So I think the Chiefs win <clears throat> because they revealed Josh Allen. Ravens win because they haven't revealed Lamar Jackson, and also the Chiefs win because they haven't revealed Mahomes. They're going to reveal him next week after they beat the Bills. They've already revealed Josh Allen. They did the same thing last year. When people thought it was the Bills, I was like, no, it's not, because they've already displayed Josh Allen two weeks before the Super Bowl. So I told everyone it wasn't the Bills. It was most likely the Chiefs, and I was right. I could be wrong this year, but I think it's going to be Baltimore. The better, They're a better team. I don't know. It just seems smarter. And on this side, I don't know. I guess I think Tampa is going to win, but I'm going to pick Detroit. And over here, I'm going to pick San Fran because they haven't displayed Brock Purdy or Lamar Jackson. And then we'll finish off right here. I don't know, guys. It's hard to pick these things, but I'm going based off that because they haven't revealed those players. And that's my logic. I could be wrong, but they did the same thing last year. So I don't know why they would change. Because a lot of people weren't going based off of that. So why would they change that? So we'll keep it like that for now and we'll go from there. 
And uh, I'm going to change my other bracket, I think. But uh, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe.